Hey y'all, how you doing? Okay girl, so a lot of you guys have been asking, oop, am I zoomed in a little too much? I was trying to show you my um, the lip application up close. So today I'm gonna show you how to apply She's Apple, which are and Coralina, which um, both of these are our limited which color is like a really um it's a coral color duh <laughs> um but it is a little shimmery so let me show you it on my hand um if you can see it is it working sorry and it's very neon um so let me just show you how to apply it really fast so you want to start off you shake the bottle as you guys know but let me show you how i apply it so you start off with clean dry lips and let me see if i should zoom in i'm going to zoom in just a little bit so you can get a good clear um, application here okay so you're going to start i'm going to show you what i do so you're going to start off like that connecting it and then go to the inside okay i don't take off product really sometimes but not not with this color. And then again. So you're dry. Starting off at the end. And again, I didn't take product off. Connecting it. And then I actually use, sometimes we'll go in again with more just like that okay so you guys can see it's a full application now if you're having a hard time with this I recommend um, if you have smaller lips and darker toned lips you may need to um, do thinner coats as in like you scrape off some of the product plenty of product and I am using more product with this okay and then I'm gonna go again top layer There you go. That is how I apply Coralina. See? Dry. Nothing's going to come off. Nice, beautiful, opaque um, finish. So I'm going to go with Opal Gloss on the top lip. Can you see? Sorry. Whoa. Opal Gloss on me is very opaque. I know some people say, like, how did she get to, how did she get that color to turn purple with opal gloss? I'm like, I don't know. I just applied it. Like you can see, all I did was apply it, and it's like I barely even had any on. And it just turned it into a pink color. Actually, it looks really pretty. I like it. Whoa, with opal gloss, this is gorgeous. Oh my gosh. I mean, it's pretty by itself too. Okay, so I'm gonna do glossy gloss on the bottom. So there you go. You can see. Glossy gloss on the bottom, opal gloss on the top with Coralina. And yeah. Let me do a kiss test for you. There you go. The opal gloss does come off, of course, but you can see. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and apply She's apple. Again, you want to make sure you shake it really well, just so it's nice and even. <clears throat> this color is also another gorgeous summer color. It is a bright, bright, bright 
right to right to right to right to right to orange. Let's see, I'm waiting for it to, there you go. This is also another color. This is um, strawberry shortcake and this is nude. But yeah, so here's she's apple. So ready, here's the application. I'm gonna, again, do the same thing as Coralina. I'm just gonna do it a little bit for you. layer two so some people may be wondering does it last as long when you apply more layers not more layers but when you apply a thicker coat I should say um, my lip scents last me about I'll say about 8 to 12 hours um, the lighter ones I'm able to do certain ones I'm able to do thinner coats um, and with that I will get a little longer wear but for me that's how long it typically lasts about eight to ten hours I'm someone who drinks a lot of water throughout the day I eat I try and eat regularly um, so yeah you're if you're someone who doesn't eat like all day I mean I do have times where I don't eat all day but usually once my lip lip sense is on I'm gonna be eating so um, and drinking and stuff like that so usually I'm going out or something like that so um, I have found that definitely it lasts me about 8 to 12 hours and sometimes I do get the reapply in the waterline but I will say if I wear my glossy gloss um, it, like put it on before I eat and right after I eat I don't have any issue with um, that whatsoever okay third application And then I'll do, let's see, sand glossy. Uh, I'm trying to think, should I do sand gloss or orchid gloss? Uh, I'll do orchid. Or should I do gold glitter? Ooh, gold glitter gloss. I'll do gold glitter gloss. And then I'll also do um, orchid gloss on the bottom. Because, I mean, this is basically what it will look like. But it'll just have the glossy gloss shimmer to it. Okay, so we pull. Ooh, I love this with nude. It's so pretty. Ooh, girl. Mmm, that's orchid gloss. So pretty. And then I'm gonna apply it with the gold glitter gloss. My gloss is running a little low. I love this gloss. I need to get a new one. Oh my gosh. This is really pretty with gold. Ooh, this looks great. With gold glitter gloss. It looks great with both, honestly. And of course you can make it matte, but... You can see the gold glitter. So, 
I hope that you guys enjoyed this. And I will see you on my next video. Bye.